Alright guys, we're here for another Toaster Tuesday, finally back. We had technical difficulties last week, so we didn't have one, but now we're back and rocking. Got the awesome cooking hat and of course the apron, signature apron on. And I'm really excited, because this is a revolutionary day in toaster cooking. Okay, see these things? These are heat resistant bags. So, me being a thinker, we got to shove these in here so we can expand our cooking line. So, I was like, what's the first thing I'm going to cook with these kick-ass bags? Well, America's favorite food, French fries! So, we got some French fries here. All I'm going to do is get one of these bags. Yeah, they look clean, I guess. And I'm just going to shove these in here because, I, you know... That's life, man. You just get shoved in a bag and thrown in toaster. So, that, ooh, I hope that fits. We're gonna make that fit. Okay, so that's what our bag looks like. It's plugged in already for some reason. I'm just gonna hopefully, oh, try to make them fit in here. We'll see if that goes down. Oh, hold on. We gotta maybe do a little rearrange in here. We gotta make them fit, otherwise it just ain't gonna work. Right, 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 right. And, there we go, they fit. So, we're just gonna make sure it's all the way up, slam it down, and hopefully the bags don't burn because they're supposed to be heat resistant. So, we're gonna let them cook. So they just popped here for the first time and it doesn't smell like they're burning. I think that's the smell from whatever we cooked last time. But for safety reasons, we always unplug it. And I'm just gonna, it's not too hot, pull it out. It smells kind of like apples, which is weird. But um, these fries were frozen. Ooh, these fries were frozen when I put it in here. I usually don't put frozen food in here, but they're french fries. They should cook pretty fast. So I'm just gonna rearrange them here. You know, make sure that the ones that were getting the heat on the outside aren't all just getting baked on the outside and the inside's getting frozen. And we're also gonna add a little sodium chloride here because we need flavoring. So um, yeah, we're just gonna add some of this quick. And that's probably good. Shake that around in there, blue. Okay, and okay, there's shook. Um, we're, we got, I think I got them all mixed up here pretty good. And so I'm gonna throw them back in here if they fit again. Oh, that worked. Plugger in, of course, a duty. Slam her down. Stay. Go down. Oh. There we go. Okay. Woo! Hot. Okay. Uh, I think they're down. Anyway, so, uh, I was thinking, I heard this, someone, you know, people ask me, like, why are you cooking crap in a toaster? And I was like, I once was told by uh, Miss Kitty Foreman that the sexiest kind of man is a man that can cook. Party guys, these things just uh, popped here for the second time, I believe. So we're just gonna, they're actually kind of starting to smell like french fries, which is good because I don't want to eat apple fries. And my bag is burning. It's just kind of melted. Huh, that's strange. Ooh, they are hot though. So, okay, I don't know why. It smells like apple french fries. This is just strange, guys. They're still not like whew, fully cooked, I don't think. They're hot, but they feel raw. That's just raw, man. So I'm gonna hope that my bags don't burn because that'd be a disappointing 98 cents down the drain. And so, yeah, I'm just gonna throw them in here again. Hope that they cook because everybody loves french fries and I'm gonna have french fries in my toaster and It broke. That's just depressing. So, um... Anyway, I'm gonna keep on cooking these french fries and we'll see how they turn out. All right, so it just popped here, but you can see see this, it just it was just steaming real nice. So I think they're cooking real, real, real nice in here. Um, 
they are hot. And my bag is turning brown. And that's disappointing, because they're supposed to be... Holy smokes, that steam's hot. Uh, I can overthink all problems. So, uh, I don't know, man. Are they done? Let me check. You know, they, they're hot and salty. And they'll probably cool down in about two minutes, just like McDonald's fries. So, I mean, they're probably good. They're, they're getting a little, the ones on the edges were actually kind of getting a little toasty. So, I'd say they're good and we're ready to eat. And we're back. Excellent. And we are ready to try it. But, of course, people are like, you don't need French fries with ketchup. But I'm like, I eat ketchup with my French fries because it's way better. So, we're gonna try them. They're still hot, I think. Okay. Mm. Hmm. That is very interesting. They are so freaking salty. I'm gonna need like a lot of water to drink after this one, but are hot, they're cooked through. I'm gonna eat some of these fat ones here. Make sure they're all cooked through. I wouldn't wanna feed you any undercooked food. My grandma definitely don't. She cremates all her food. Trust me, it ain't undercooked. Anyway, I'm thinking these are pretty good. <laughs> like, party man. Yeah, so. I'm gonna keep eating until I'm gonna save some for a dog, like always. And this has been really good, but just just take a look at this. This is the bag that we just used. This is a new bag. Like, look at that. That's disappointing. This one bag cost me like freaking forty nine cents. <sighs> Crazy man. And it took like four weeks to get here, which made it even worse. And so, these are delicious. I might have to incorporate it more. And stay tuned for when we feed the dog, of course. One last thing, guys, before we go feed the dog. They don't even taste like apples. That's, that's just good, man. All right, so we're out here with Roscoe. How's it going, boy? Yeah, sit. So he knows he has to sit. And I'm sure he's going to love these fries because... He missed again. He just doesn't learn. And you missed that one. Ready, Roscoe? Whoop! Okay, anyway. So, he's enjoying them. Yeah, you are. Anyway, I think he was expecting, like, a big old steak. But he ain't getting one. He's getting those french fries. And thanks for watching again, like always. I greatly appreciate it. Makes me feel wanted. Anyway. Um, cook up some fries in a toaster. And we'll be back next week for sure.